a new success for SpaceX. It happened after an unmanned rocket lifted off from the Kennedy Space Center in Florida today. The mission? To test whether a crew can abort and escape safely after liftoff. Here's Meg Oliver. Liftoff. It was a ride designed to fail. Under hazy blue skies, the SpaceX Crew Dragon lifted off carrying astronaut test dummies. But about 84 seconds into flight, the Falcon 9 rocket shut down its engines as planned, simulating an emergency. The escape system blasted the crew capsule away from the rocket at more than twice the speed of sound. Escaping an explosion, parachutes brought it to a safe splashdown in the Atlantic. Overall, as far as we can tell thus far, it is a picture-perfect mission. Uh, it went as well as one could possibly expect. It was the last major test for SpaceX. They need to know astronauts can abort and escape safely before they begin flying them into space. Getting it done successfully, which appears to be the case, uh, was a very big step forward for SpaceX and for NASA. Boeing is also part of this new American space race, but last month they failed to dock their ship with the space station during an uncrewed flight test. NASA needs both companies to succeed. Both of these companies will be launching regular crew rotation flights to the station starting later this year, ending NASA's sole reliance on Russian Soyuz spacecraft. SpaceX could launch two astronauts sometime this spring. Meg Oliver, CBS News, New York.